Hi everyone, it's Tammy and it's Sunday. Um, Steve and I did go to another estate sale and um, again it was another uh, woman who had her um, some of her estate jewelry uh, there. So I did pick up some pieces and I thought I'll show them to you because I'll be sending out um, your parcels this week and I figured if anybody that ordered already from me wanted some of these pieces, I could put them in uh, your bag and send them off to you. So I'll show them to you, um, you know, whatever sells fine, whatever doesn't, I'll show again after the new year. Okay, I'm going to start out with this crystal set. This is absolutely stunning. It is a vintage crystal set. It has four strands on this. It is stunning. And then it has the um, shepherd's clasp. It's beautiful. It has the bracelet to go with it. And again, normally when you find these type of um, necklaces, you usually just um, find the necklace. You don't find the bracelet and the earrings to match, so that's a bonus. This is what the bracelet looks like. It's so beautiful. And then this is the um, clip earrings. And they're very pretty. And I will put the necklace on so that you can see what it looks like. Steve is just getting ready to leave for work, so um, he may be passing in the background a little bit because he's um, packing his truck. Okay. So, this is what that looks like. And it's stunning, and it's so hard not to keep these pieces. They're just beautiful quality. You can feel the quality in them. I'll try and get the light on there. And that's what they look like. And for that set, I wanted 55 And it's a very good price. Okay. Um, and then I have this cat necklace, which I had to have. It is beautiful. Um, he has his little feet here. Let me get it straightened out. Look at his little feet. And that's what he looks like. And he has, it's a type of a, um, I don't know if it's a bone, and then it has, or it may be a type of precious stone. I'm not sure. I'm going to put that light a little closer. There we go. And that's what he looks like. And he also has the stone on his head. There was quite a few people who wanted this piece, but I got him. And that's what he looks like. And that's the back of him. He is definitely vintage. And for that one, I wanted 50. Okay, um, I have the sterling silver square hinged bangle. And that is this one. It's square. And it has your safety clasp here. And just a minute. I'll open it for you so that you can hear that it clasps good. Okay? It has a very nice clasp on it. Um, this is all sterling silver I'm going to show you next. It has a beautiful, it has beautiful work here. And um, I have one here um, that I'm keeping. That's what it looks like. I do have to... The clasp is a little bit loose on this one. I need to fix it. But I thought it would look nice with my other silver um, um, bracelets. Just nice stackable. And that's what it looks like on. And it just has a different design on it, but it's the same concept. Okay, and for this one, I wanted 55 Okay, now I have the pink and crystal dining, uh, dinner ring, rather. And this one would be, let's see, this one would be a size 8. And this is what it looks like. It's stunning. I don't know if you can see that. I'm not getting the light very good, honey. It's a nice pink stone. It's got crystals around it. 
and you can see right here in the four corners where it's set, the pink crystal is set in there. It's beautiful, and that's the setting. It's vintage. It's sterling silver. It's got a nice, nice thick band. It's just beautiful. These are nice, nice dinner rings, and then again, and then they're sterling silver, so these will last you a long, long time and something to pass down. And for that one, I wanted 55. And then I got this beautiful purple and pink dining, um, or rather dinner ring, I keep saying dining. And this one is large. It's probably a 10 or an 11. It has a nice purple stone in the middle, and then it has the pink around it, the nice baby pink, and these are crystals as well. And then look at, look at all of the work in there, how beautiful that setting is. And you have a nice thick band. And that again is 925 sterling. And these, these are very old pieces. And they told me as much as they could. But they are definitely old rings. And for that one I wanted 60. This one, it's a dark blue, almost like that blue stone that um, you see on the Titanic that he gives her. Um, and it looks druzy. It looks like a druzy. I just, I had to have it. Look at the setting. Look how nice and high the setting is and how well done this ring is. It's nice and thick. Again, 925 sterling silver. This is quite old. This one would be a size... Okay, I take a six there. This would be a seven. Look at this. I hope you can catch those stones. I'm going to take you to the window. Okay, let's turn like this. Can you see that? Look at those stones. They almost look like a druzy. There's, I don't know, 20 to 30 stones in there. They're all well, well set in there. That's a, just a gorgeous, gorgeous ring. I've never, ever seen that color before. I don't want to drop you guys. And that's what it, it's just beautiful. It's so hard for me not to keep these rings because I love chunky rings. Um, and for that one, I wanted 60 as well. I have a black stone sterling silver ring. Um, this one would be a size, I think a size nine. That's what this one looks like. It's got a nice black stone in there. It's very different the way it's made, the design. And it's got a nice thick sterling silver band. And again, this is all her jewelry. <clears throat> and for that one, I wanted 35. And this one I'm keeping for myself. It's gorgeous. I love it. It's got a heart crystal or maybe an Austrian crystal or it could be a um, um, cubic. But it's so, so pretty. I just love it. Okay, and what else do I have? Okay, I have some small rings here. All of these are sterling silver and they will be $20 each. This one is a um, moon with a star. Can you see the way that's made? We've moved my desk because we've um, renovated the living room. We've um, changed up the furniture. So I'm over here. I'm hoping the lighting is better. And this one would be a size six. So again, for these smaller ones, I want 20. Then I have this one that has a mother of pearl. This one would be a size five. That's the mother of pearl. It's beautiful. And then I have this black onyx heart. This one would be a five as well. See the heart, and then between it, it has the, the nice uh, strip of silver there, and it is very cute. 
and that's black onyx. There were so much, she had so much jewelry. I wish I could, I could have stayed for it all. We were six hours, six hours sitting at that, that auction. That's how much um, jewelry and, and memorabilia they had and collectors, collect collective items, that type of thing. Okay, this is a size eight. Oh, I already showed you this one. Sorry. <laughs> I'm half asleep. Ah, uh, Tam. Okay. And then I have this one. This one is a dolphin with a little ball that he's playing with. He's sterling silver, and he is about a six and a half. Okay. And... Then I have this cute little guy. I love him. He's sterling silver, and he's a little pig, and his little feet move. Look at his little face. You got to see his little face, his little pig nose. <laughs> he is so adorable. Look at him. That is so sweet. And for him, I wanted 20. Okay, and the star pin. I have this beautiful vintage star pin that she had. And it looks like a, a starfish is what it looks like. It has all the Aurora Borealis here, all the original stones. It doesn't look like any of them have been um, uh, reset. It's so, so beautiful. And then the back is done so nicely. This is vintage. And I, I was very, very fortunate to go to these um, two estate sales and get what I did get. I wish I could have stayed. They had so, so, she had so many um, sterling silver rings that had uh, the turquoise stones in them, but it was really hard to get. The prices were going like crazy. So, um, you know, I, I stuck to my guns for a few of these dinner rings that I just thought were gorgeous. Um, anyway, I did the best I could, girls. Okay, and then I have this rhinestone set, and apparently the family said that um, she had paid $100 for it. Now, I'm asking 60 for it. This is what it looks like. It's stunning. I don't think this is rhinestones. This has got to be crystals if she paid 100 I, back then. This is what that one looks like. It's very, very beautiful. It's just gorgeous. And then it has the nice, pretty crystal earrings to match. Okay, and then I have this bracelet. This was this is also vintage. This was part of it, part of the estate sale. Um, this is not sterling silver. This is, you know, a, a, a costume piece, and it has black stones in it with aurora borealis. And I'm getting my ring stuck in there, and it is gorgeous. Look how beautiful that is. I love it. There's only two Aurora Borealis stones that I have to replace in it. You know, when you have a piece that's vintage, uh, you're bound to lose a few stones. But it's gorgeous. And um, what did I have for that one? 25. Okay. And I think that's it, girls. Oh, the sterling silver hoop earrings I'm wearing. These are 925 sterling silver. They're nice and thick. They're beautiful. And um, it's very hard for me not to keep them because I love them. That's my type of earring. And for those, I want 35. And that's it. So I will upload this. Um, I hope you guys can find something for Christmas. I'm going to try, well, I will definitely get your parcels out next week, or this week coming rather, and uh, you'll definitely have them for Christmas. So I'll talk to you then. Love you. Bye-bye.